In this video, I will show you how you can retain GA4 or Google Analytics Force data forever. So if you're ready, let's dive in. When you implement Google Analytics 4, by default, it retains your data for only two months. So if you have to look at the data prior to two months, then you are out of luck if you do not change the data retention setting. In order to get to that setting, click on admin and then click on data setting and data retention. And this is where you'll see the data retention setting. By default, it's two months. However, you can extend the data retention to 14 months. So make sure to set it to 14 months and click on save. However, if you want the data to be there for more than 14 months, then what do you do? As you can see, there is no other option in GA4, but there is another feature that you can use to retain your data forever. And that feature is the one that allows you to send the data from GA4 or Google Analytics 4 over to BigQuery. BigQuery is a data warehouse by Google Cloud. However, keep in mind that BigQuery is not entirely free. It is free up to an extent. Before you proceed and decide to send the data over to BigQuery, make sure you go to the pricing section of BigQuery and then check how much you'll end up paying. Once you're satisfied and you do want to send your data over to BigQuery, then you'll set up the linkage between GA4 and BigQuery within GA4 admin panel. So let's go to GA4 and exit out of the data retention screen. Scroll down and where you see product links, click on BigQuery links. This is where you'll be able to connect GA4 to BigQuery and send the data from GA4 over to BigQuery. Click on link, then it'll ask you to choose a BigQuery project. Clicking on it will open all the projects that you have. Click the project that you want, click on confirm. At this point, you might be wondering, what is a project? When you sign up for BigQuery, you will be creating a project in BigQuery. That is the project which will contain all the data that you will be sending from GA4 to BigQuery. If you want to learn everything about BigQuery and how to use GA4 data in BigQuery, then enroll in the BigQuery for Marketers and Marketing Analyst course. The link to that course is available in the description of this video. Once you select the project, click on Next and set the frequency of the data that you will be sending to BigQuery. There are two options available, daily and streaming. Daily means it'll be sent at the end of the day. Streaming sends the real-time data. Pick the options that you want and then click on Next. Next is the review screen. Make sure everything is correct. And if it is, then click on Submit. There are a few other things that you will have to set before the data can flow from GA4 to BigQuery. I'm not going to cover those steps in this video. Here, I just wanted to show you the options you have to extend the GA4 data retention. I have covered all those steps in another video. The link to that video is also available in the description of this video. Once you submit it and set everything up, the data will start to flow into BigQuery. So I'm going to go to BigQuery and show you how that data looks. In BigQuery, the GA4 data will show up under the project that you selected and the data will be contained in the data set that starts with analytics. Clicking on the data set will show you all the tables that are in that data set. Here, I have a few other tables, but don't worry about them. The tables that you will see in your data set are events and events intraday. Events contain the daily data. This is populated at the end of the day. Events intraday contains the real-time data. Events intraday will only appear if you choose the streaming option in GA4 interface. Once the data is in BigQuery, it'll remain there forever. However, please note that you cannot take this data and see it in the GA4 interface. In order for you to use this data, you will either have to write SQL or SQL queries to pull the data that you want or use Looker Studio along with BigQuery. So that's it. This is how you can extend the data retention in GA4. So to recap, you have two options. One, 
you can extend the data retention within GA4 interface up to 14 months. Second, you can send the data to BigQuery from GA4. When you send the data to BigQuery, it is retained forever. I hope you like this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up, leave a comment for me, and don't forget to check the links in the description of this video. I will see you in the next video.